Last week's drama regarding the near firing of Sam Altman had the attention of the entire world. Now it's come out that one of the things that led to the temporary breakup of OpenAI was the discovery of something so powerful and scary that it even frightened the people who were working on it. Welcome back, AI Nexus. I'm Alex Shepard. Today we're delving into a topic that's sending shockwaves through the AI community, OpenAI's Project Q. Hold on to your seats, because this revelation is a real game changer in the world of artificial intelligence. So what exactly is Q, and how does it fit into the quest for AGI? Let's dive in. As you surely know, last week there was some chaos over at OpenAI. In the span of less than a week, the company's board fired its CEO Sam Altman, put in a new CEO, Mira Moradi, then promptly replaced her with Twitch CEO Emmett Shear, then did a full 360 and reinstated Altman after some massive backlash. In the initial hours of this, madness, people started wildly speculating about why this happened. After two to three days, most media settled on the narrative that there was infighting in the company due to the division between AI pessimists and AI optimists. Essentially, AI pessimists are fearful of the possibilities of AI and want to slow down development, making safety a priority over profits. They're driven by a deeply held belief that AI could spell the end of humanity. You know those science fiction books and films where humanity ends up fighting a battle against armies of robots? Think iRobot and The Matrix. Only the first two installments are good, by the way. AI pessimists want to reduce the speed of developing AI so it can be thoroughly tested and regulated, even if it means sacrificing earnings and profits. Meanwhile, the optimists tend to view AI development as a natural progression of human technology. They advocate for unrestrained progress when it comes to working on new AI models and advancing toward AGI, which we'll explain more in detail later. There are, of course, economic motivations, as the optimists are also happy to get the latest and greatest products out on the market ASAP and make nice money off of them. Altman is hands down one of the AI optimists. So why is this important? Well, just a couple of days ago, Reuters reported that in the weeks before the firing of Altman, researchers working on a secret project at OpenAI made a discovery. And not just any discovery, one that was so powerful that it even scared some of the most optimistic employees within the company. The discovery was related to a project known internally as QSTAR. Let's take a look at what we know about Project QSTAR. From what we know so far, it's not just another AI model along the lines of ChatGPT. ChatGPT is a predictive LLM, or large language model, and for the most part, it has been trained on data in order to answer questions. For example, if you ask it a random question, such as what color are the markings on a European fire salamander, it will tell you, yellow. Not because it's an expert in salamander biology, but because at some point, it was taught that European fire salamanders have yellow markings. What makes QSTAR different is that it was reportedly able to answer questions that had answers it had not been trained on. The full details have not been released, but inside sources revealed that the new AI platform was able to apply logic to solve math problems that it had never been trained on. The fact that it can solve problems that are beyond the scope of its training data might be an indication that OpenAI have gotten a step closer to AGI. In case you're not familiar with the term, AGI stands for Artificial General Intelligence. It refers to a stage in AI in which it will be capable of learning on its own and deducing things without the need to train it on everything. In other words, it's a breakthrough in the progress toward a super intelligence that could potentially outperform humans in virtually all tasks. We're talking about a system that doesn't just learn from information, but can apply reasoning and solve problems at a human level. In a way, AGI could be the necessary breakthrough for people to have futuristic computers and robots that can be autonomous. Imagine a world with AGI-powered medical robots that can outperform even the best surgeons and specialists we have today. Or AGI-based engineers that can help humans develop perpetually clean and everlasting energy sources that benefit all forms of life on Earth. Sounds great, right? Well, there is also a dark side. As the pessimists might propose, we might have AGI-powered nuclear physicist robots who can single-handedly develop a rogue country's nuclear weapons program, or AGI scientists developing harmful biological arms, methods of manipulating humans, and more. Alex Shepard here, AI Nexus. Sounds kind of scary, but you know what? We base everything off of human thought. We don't actually know what an artificial general intelligence is capable of doing or thinking. While it may seem scary at the moment, do keep in mind that all of these fears are based on human creativity. 
So, as you can see, it might be understandable that the Q-Star breakthrough might have done more than raise eyebrows. It raised serious concerns and fears. As you might have expected, Elon Musk weighed in on the situation, suggesting that this discovery even scared Ilya Sutskever, an influential board member and a main AI engineer at OpenAI. He noted in a tweet that something scared Ilya enough to want to fire Sam. The fact that now Altman is back seems to send the signal that OpenAI is going to move forward quickly and without reservations. This means that QSTAR might be developed further, without stopping to think of what it might lead to. This could be good and it could be bad, but again, whether it will be beneficial or dangerous is yet to be known. At this point, we don't even know many exact details about QSTAR, but the fact that some details have emerged makes certain ethical challenges arise. We know, for example, that with great power comes great responsibility. The development of QSTAR raised serious ethical concerns among OpenAI's own researchers. They warned of the potential dangers this powerful algorithm could pose to humanity. It even led to a temporary shakeup in OpenAI's leadership, highlighting the deep divisions over the project's direction. So what measures have been put in place to make sure that this technology does not get out of OpenAI's hands? Are they actively doing anything to ensure that QSTAR or other AI breakthroughs will be controllable and beneficial to humanity? Much of this information is not known, as QSTAR is being kept under wraps and is highly confidential. It might be a long time before we know more details about this potentially revolutionary discovery, but meanwhile, it is impossible to ignore the potential impact. AGI, like QSTAR, isn't just a technological marvel. It could very well be a societal game changer. OpenAI CEO Sam Altman sees AGI as a co-worker, capable of tasks ranging from coding to medicine, but this comparison has stirred the pot. It's obvious that now, OpenAI is betting on the positive outcomes of AGI, but many in the AI community argue that the pursuit of commercial success might overshadow some other critical considerations, especially those related to the well-being of society. The speed at which AGI is advancing is outpacing our ability to understand its full impact, raising alarms about job security and societal roles. Even if we are on the optimistic side of the debate, it is possible that the arrival of AGI could spell the end of millions of jobs worldwide. Even the most skilled workers, especially in white-collar jobs, might quickly become obsolete. And it would merely be a matter of time before robotics catches on to AGI and replaces many manual workers, such as those in factories, food service, cleaning, and more. This might create global depression, masses of disaffected and impoverished workers, and possible widespread unrest and discontent. QSTAR might be one of the first platforms to step into the exciting and scary waters of AGI. It might take a long time to realize its consequences, though the way things are going now, it might be a very short time. Depending on who you ask, we might be on the verge of either a utopia or a futuristic nightmare. Project Q is a testament to the incredible strides we're making in AI, but as we stand on the brink of creating super intelligence, we must tread carefully, balancing innovation with ethical responsibility. Stay tuned to AI Nexus as we continue to unravel the evolving narrative of AGI and its impact on our world. Still hungry for more of the latest AI developments? Then you definitely need to see this video.